Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel, Mark Wardell Creations. Uh, today I want to do something inspired to me by uh, Charmin Khan. And uh, um, if you haven't seen her stuff, it's gorgeous. She does these beautiful blooms. So what we're going to do is we're going to have a... We're going to have um, this... I don't know, it's a... Um, a mauve maybe color going through here and we're going to have white and then more of this mauve uh this is a uh, glidden it was a uh, paint that was made the wrong color you can find them on sale they're, they're called mistakes and so i'm not sure exactly what color it is but that's what i got a whole gallon of this uh for nine dollars so whenever i see Whenever I go to Lowe's or Home Depot and I see, you know, mistake paints setting out on sale, I usually grab them because they're a good buy. Okay, let's get started. No music today. <laughs> All right. I'm going to start right here. We're going to kind of run it down this way. Okay. Hope everybody's doing just great today. I'm out here painting, so I'm good. <laughs> I've got to put some, I usually put some paint down on the sides where I put my canvas down. I've got, I'm going to have to pick it up and put some paint under it. So, a little stick. Uh, let's go ahead and do that. Okay. There we go. Stick on. All right, I think that'll fly. All righty. Okay. And get this. Whoa. Okay. Get this down here. Actually, I want to go up a little higher than that. There we go. Okay. Get this spread out. Oh, man. I'm pooped. I, want, I took a vacation day tomorrow, so... I've, I've got to get my... I'm having a problem with the, my phone, the internet. I can't upload anything right now because something's going on with the internet. So I've got to go up to the phone company tomorrow and try to get it all straightened out. So. Okay. 
Okay. I watched Gandhi, the movie Gandhi. I watched that today for the first time. It's a really good movie. I really like it. I think that's a lesson the whole world could could use. I'm trying to get this done as fast as I can. Almost done. All right. Okay, we got that done. Let's do the middle. Let's do it with the white. The white is the PGA uh, Pro and the uh, in the eggshell. Uh. Paper towel. Okay, get this spread out real quick and we'll get with it. I'll trade I'll trade a painting for, for gas. <laughs> Can you believe how I gas it right now. God, I can't believe it. Right in time for summer. And it's almost time to get out there and make money and all this crazy crap's going on. Great, huh? <laughs> uh, there's way too much paint on there. I'm going to scrape what I can of it off. Man, that PG, that PPG paint, God, it's thick. It's hard to, you know, if you do use this paint, you may want to add a little flow trial to it and take some of the thickness out of it because it is really, really thick. All right. I'm going to spin this a little bit. It helps to even out the paint. Okay. Back this way a little bit. I don't want to have to spin this very much when I finish up, so I'm going to spin a lot of it off now. Lost our corner over here. I'm going to come back after I get some of this off and... Put a little bit of that lavender back on. All right, that looks pretty good. All right. And I'm going to come back and put a little bit more lavender off in here. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. All right, this is what we got planned. Uh, we're going to have a couple of blooms up here. Maybe three blooms up here and three blooms down here. And uh, then we're going to modify the blooms and hopefully come out with something beautiful. Okay. I'm going to change gloves real quick because these are already all nasty. I'm sorry it's taking me so long to get some new videos out, but like I said, I've, I've got some trouble with my internet service. The 5G thing's messing up real bad or something, and uh, I will get it fixed, straightened out tomorrow, or I'll have a new phone company <laughs> tomorrow, one way or another. But, and I'll have, I've got four new videos to load up for you, so if you're watching this, that means I already loaded them. <laughs> All right. We're going to do our first bloom about, well, let's go ahead. I want to put some leaves in first so I can put the blooms in between the leaves. And when we go to embellish it, I'll, I'll turn these into leaves. This one here. Let's put one about right here. And let's put one about right here. Okay. Same down here. Let's put one about right here. And let's put one about right here. Okay. And we're going to go ahead and put some cell activator on there. I'm using black cell activator. Three parts Australian flow trial. One part paint. I'm using oxide black by Amsterdam. I do them one at a time because if I put it all on there, it'll sink too low on the other ones before I can get to them to blow them out. And I blow them out with my little, my little world's smallest blower. I love this thing. I try to blow them out so I'll be able to get a leaf look out of it. Okay. The green I laid down here is a um, parakeet by Primary Elements. I mixed it a little light, but I'm hoping this black will make, make it pop where I need it to. doesn't show up very good but 
by the time we're done with the blooms, you're just going to see hints of it. So, I think it'll be all right. All right, got our leaves down. Now we'll start doing our flowers. When I do my flowers. I like to, I like to. Keep, I don't put the colors on top of it. I like to keep the colors separated a little bit so you get a good burst of each color in each petal. So, in other words, I'm trying. Each petal is going to be. A dot color. Each color is going to be a petal the way I'm going to blow it out. Okay. Um, this is Cronacridone uh, Nickel Azel Gold. Uh, this is Dioxon Purple from uh, Golden Fluid. Uh, this is Diary of Light Yellow by Golden Fluid. Okay. This is Blue Eyes by this little piggy. Blue Bayou by Primary Elements. Pumpkin Spice by Primary Elements. Alright. That's our flower colors. Our petal colors. Get our cell activator. And all the, the, all the paint colors and the pouring medium will be in the description. The pouring medium is the, the uh, porch and floor by Valspar, 1%. And then the Valspar Ultra, 1%. And then the Josonio Varnish, 1%. Oh, I like that pumpkin spice. Isn't that beautiful? Primary elements, they got some beautiful colors. Alright, there's our first bloom. Now, you can take a straw. If you have some areas with cell activator still. You can go in there and blow a little bit and pick up some more of that paint and get a few more cells. All right. Let's do the second one. We're going to do it right here.
Oops. Uh, we'll get to that. We'll fix that in a little bit. So I hope you've been enjoying my videos. Uh, like I said before, anything that you want to see you hadn't seen, and I don't have that much out right now, but anything y'all want to want to see, put it in the description, and I'll, I'll try my best to deliver it for you. i got a lot of stuff coming up. Um, we're going to do some chain pull stuff here coming up real soon. Um, I'm going to do some wooden boxes and stuff like that. Uh, got a lot of stuff to do, so hoping everything will work out right, and I'll be able to get to everything without any more problems with my internet and stuff. Okay. Oh man, this is looking killer. Okay, now we're going to do three more blooms. We're going to do one here, one here, and one in the middle here. And then we'll get to modifying it. Okay. Oops, I didn't really want to put that there, it just accident. Okay. Let's put some of this on that yellow. Get some orange out of it. Okay. Okay. That's that blue eyes. I think I really like that. Oh, that's what's looking pretty. Yeah. Alright. Now then. Do 
another one in the middle here. Hmm. I wouldn't take care of all that later. Okay. Let's get this balloon blown out. Okay, I'm gonna hit this middle real quick. Try to get a little more out of that. There we go. Okay. I want to blow that red out a little bit more too. Let's blow this out a little bit more. Uh, so we get much more out of it. Okay. <sighs> Not that blue. I can get that out a little bit. Alright. Okay. I think we can put one more right here. Or you know what? Up here would probably be better, huh? Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Pretty colors, huh?
Alright. Yeah, I like that. Not bad. You drip on there. <laughs> you can just go back and put a little bit more paint on. No big deal. I got a chunk on there. I'm just gonna put a little fresh paint right in here. top of that yellow. Okay. All right. You know what time it is now? It's fun time. Skier time. go. I like to start with the leaves and kind of get them established first. So let's see. Um, let's make a set of leaves going out like this. Okay. Some kind of mutant leaf thing going on there anyway. Like it so far. 
Okay, let, uh, let's start embellishing the blooms. I like to try to use the colors to divide these up sections up into petals. I try to pull everything to what looks like the center of the flower. Okay. Alright. And I like to come in here and put these little things like this on the petals. Okay, let's go to this. Now, Charmin, she, I love the way she embellishes, but I try to not copy somebody else's style, take their idea, and kind of put your own spin on it. It shows a little faith in yourself and a little respect for the artist that created the look. And uh, that's what I try to do anyway. Yeah, this, these types of paintings are, they're very fun. Uh, you need to spend a lot of time embellishing to make them really look good. Uh, but, you know, that's part of the fun of doing this style of painting is getting creative with, with your embellishments. You know, because... You're making things that, you know, are, there's no way to do it wrong because this is your creation. In your mind, that's what your flower looks like. Okay. I got some really cool cells in here. When I get finished and give you the close-up, you'll see some of these cells are really cool. Some of them are kind of hard to see, though. That purple gets really dark in there. the 
little split in there. Okay. If I don't run out of time on my camera on this, I forgot to look at it and see what I had. Like that. Alright, let's swing it right here and do these. In these videos, I'm trying to keep within about 30 minutes. Uh, sometimes I'd like to take a lot more time with my embellishments, but uh, for the sake of the length of the video, I have to try to get to as much as I can, as quick as I can. But, man, you can, you can just, you can do so much embellishing. You can do skewers, you can come in here with a, a balloon and do balloon kisses on some of the colors to make other kinds of, uh, flower looking effects there's so much you can do anything that you can come up with let's see here uh if you're an artist uh, send me some of your pictures i would love to see some of y'all stuff You have a channel and trying to get going like me uh reach out to me i'd love to check your channel out and uh subscribe to it meet some good friends Well, the world sure needs some beauty in it right now, doesn't it? <laughs> There's enough darkness. But, there's a lot of beauty and light, too. Uh, a lot of beautiful things around us every day we take for granted and don't really pay attention to, but it's there. It's there. Our problem is we don't appreciate it enough and we don't take care of it. It's a wonderful gift that we should take better care of than we do. All right. Well, Got some beautiful colors out of this, though. Really like it. Well, that's pretty much it. Uh, we're going to give it some spins and see if we can spin it out a little bit and stretch these cells out a little bit. And uh, I think we'll have a finished painting here. Here we go. Let me spin it. back the other way a couple of times. Oh yeah, that grew a lot. Okay. Well, what do you think? 
Like that. Or like that. I think I like it. Maybe even sideways. Like, nah. Hmm. Okay. Let me get you up for close up. Oh, that's not working out good. I still haven't done anything about that. Stick it. Huh. Okay. Flip around. Okay. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining me this evening and I hope you had some fun. Uh, maybe gave you some ideas, I hope. Uh, I'm hoping that I should get my chains in any day now. Uh, I'm hoping within the next couple of videos I'll, I'll be doing some chain pull uh, paintings for you. Alright, well thank you so much for coming to my channel. Thank you so much for watching my video. As always, God bless. Uh, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.